Hi, my name is Rachel Barnett with Gentle Frog. In today's video of QuickBooks Training, I'm going to show you how to reset the password for your QuickBooks desktop product. I'm using QuickBooks Premier 2019. These steps are going to work whether you're in QuickBooks Pro, QuickBooks Premier, or QuickBooks Enterprise. The first thing you'll want to do is click on the top menu bar where it says Help, and then go down to the bottom of the list where it says About QuickBooks. In my case, it says Account and Desktop 2019. Yours will say Pro or Premier Enterprise. It'll say something else. Don't worry about that. Just click on the About QuickBooks. Toward the bottom of your screen, you're going to see the license number and the product number. You can't copy and paste this. What I tend to do is just use my, my screen capture. I use snipping tool, but however it is, you take screenshots. I tend to take a screenshot of it because you'll need this information in just a few minutes. You're also welcome to write it down. All you need is the license number. You do not need your product number. So once you have that, then you'll go and attempt to open your QuickBooks file. Once you have that, we need to get to the login screen for your QuickBooks file. So in my case, I keep my QuickBooks in QBox, and it's this one that I can't open. I know what my password was, but for some reason it's not working. To the right of the word password, you want to click on I forgot my password. This is why you needed your license number earlier. So I'm going to fill this in real quick. Once you have that entered, go ahead and click on OK. And it says QuickBooks needs to verify your information. A password reset code has been sent to your email address. If I didn't get the earlier information correct, nothing would be sent to my email address. Get the code. I'm just going to copy and paste it. Paste. Oh, thank goodness. I did not want to type all that. Click on the blue OK. And that gives me a chance to enter a new password. This one I'll write down. So let's see what we got. Name of oldest nephew. So let's try the password that we just created. Okay. All right, so it did let me in and it says I need to change my password. Seems a little silly considering that's how we got here in the first place, but let's do it. All right, it says my password has been changed. So if this happens to you, that's the steps to change your password for QuickBooks Desktop. This only works if you're the administrator. If you're a user or an employee of the company, you won't be able to do this. You'll need to ask your company administrator to change the password for you. Ask your administrator to log in the QuickBooks using their credentials. They'll come up to the top menu and click on Company, and then they'll go down to Set up Users and Passwords. We'll change, we'll say set up users. And so we'll add a user, sample. We'll give sample a password. Give them all areas of QuickBooks to expedite this. And finish. So for example, if sample came up to me and said, you know what? I just can't remember my password. You can come over here and you can say edit user. And then you can change the password right here. So whatever you want to change it to. And then click on next and next and yes and finish. And then the, the password for sample has now been changed. You can click close. Hopefully that helps you if you're stuck trying to get into QuickBooks and not sure of your password, that's two routes to reset it. One route for the administrator and one route for an employee or a user of the QuickBooks file. If you have any questions about QuickBooks, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. You can send me an email, you can schedule an appointment, or you can leave a note in the comments. If you have any ideas for topics that you'd like to see me do in the future, please don't hesitate to let me know. Thank you so much.